It hurts in more ways than one. There, there's different kinds of hurt. I mean, there's the physical, which pretty much anyone can handle. And, and then there's the emotional that's 10 times worse. Name calling, pushing, fights. Heartbreaking personal experiences shared by students at an event aimed at putting an end to bullying. The teens gathered with dozens of educators and activists to shed light on the issue. I'm here to tell you it could be any one of your sons or daughters, your brothers, your sisters. Students say they can't escape the problem. Not only are they experiencing bullying in the hallways, but on the internet too. Name calling, pushing, shoving, you know, just um, things like that. While it hurts, there is hope, and students say this forum gives them something to hold on to until the bullying ends. It also lets them know that they have community leaders on their side working to stop the cruelty. I am who I am, and I won't change that for anybody. What I've heard so far is pretty amazing, and it's to the point. To stop bullying and realize it's really bad and that it can lead people to suicide, and that's really not good. In Traverse City, Lorne Amstutz, 7 and 4 News.